Francisco. Great Palestine, who won the war? In Great Britain, the Tribune magazine named him the most important investigative journalist of our time. But in the US, where he was born, Greg Palast's report for BBC Television's Newsnight and The Guardian paper are all but banned. Palast's most recent book, The Best Democracy Money Can Buy, has been on the New York Times bestseller list for months. But Palast needs to maintain residence in London in order to do his investigative work. Palast has broken some of the biggest stories of recent years. How Catherine Harris rigged the 2000 election in favor of Bush by illegally removing African Americans from voter rolls. And how Bush stopped the FBI's investigation of the Bin Laden family prior to the 9-11 attack. In part one, you heard how George W. Bush avoided going to Vietnam by getting into the Texas Air Guard. Palast also named some of the winners of the war on Iraq, such as Lockheed Martin and the Carlyle Group. Now you will hear how the voter fraud in Florida was engineered with the help of a company that might run future elections in the U.S. The name is Choice Point. Also coming up is the Bin Laden Bush connection. Here is Greg Palast. Going back to